I'm Johnny, and it's time for some more musical modes. If you haven't watched my little rant about the baby eating nature of Western musical theory, you need to go do that like right now. It's right up there. Go click. I'll wait. No, I won't really wait. Just pause and go hit it, okay? In that video, I talked a little bit about the shapes of the scales, and that got me thinking and really researching Erisian modes which were basically note scales based on just the black keys. I started doing some analysis on the intervals between the notes, and I found some pretty interesting things. Always, in all of those scales, the intervals are in a tight range. You will never get the so-called minor second or major seventh intervals. Basically, like where it's one semitone away from the primary note. You'll also never get a tritone. And I found this rather interesting. So I started doing a little bit more analysis and I looked. When you take the Eriskian modes and you stack them all up like this, then you get what I like to call the mode of Callisti the prettiest one. This is every possible interval in every possible Erisian mode in one single scale. So this one's a bit weird. It's got eight notes instead of five or even seven. It makes kind of this shape. That's one of the things I want to put out there is that we can explore scales in terms of these star shapes and you get a real intuitive sense of how that is going to sound. So more details, including the intervals, are on my website if you want to go check it out. When I was doing this, it got me thinking, how many five note scales do we have amongst the 12 possible notes in Western musical theory, which we all know is a baby eating cargo cult. And it turns out that's actually a bit of a fascinating question because it's, I'm gonna get this all wrong. It's called a binomial coefficient. Or, uh, the cool thing is you can use a Pascal's triangle to determine what that is. Anyways, it's maybe for another video, but the upshot of all this is that there's 792 possible combinations of five note scales amongst the 12 notes that we've got. Yowza. That's a lot of scales. So what is this Callisti mode even good for? Does it even sound good? Well, that's kind of why I'm bringing it up. Cause I mean, the Arisian modes are neat and stuff. They have lots of perfect fours and perfect fifths, but you know what? It's a lot like craft dinner. You're gonna get something that's edible, but it's pretty bland. With Callisti, the prettiest one, it's much different. You can even see it. There's a symmetry here that looks good and I think it will sound even better. I'm not just saying that either. I made an ambient track. The story behind this is also kind of cool. A friend at work and I decided to do an epic ambient battle. That's where you and the other guy who's about to be doomed battle it out by each making a track and whoever makes the best track at the end of it wins. We're going two out of three. Yeah, it's as crazy as it sounds. But last weekend was the initial throwdown and I did use the Callisti mode. I think it sounds good, so go check it out. It's on SoundCloud, free download. Some of you might argue that it's not exactly ambient, and I'm kind of on your side. I started, and it was sounding really ambient and good, but then I added one drum machine, and then one drum machine went to another, and you know, here we are. But in my defense, if I'm making ambient music for my studio, what's it gonna have? That's right. Lots of pounding drum machines, two 303s, and an amen break. That's what comes out of my studio. That is the ambience of my studio. I'm still communing with Bunny Jesus, and he still says, send me your bunny. There's only four slots left. So send them early, send them often. A little note, sleepy bunnies are not gonna be as interesting as the other bunnies. So if you don't wanna even change your bunny, go right on ahead. And remember, tearing down the established edifice of musical theory and its baby-eating cult nature is fun. Seven hundred and twenty-nine. Seven hundred and ninety-two. Gonna do another couple of takes. Hang on. Seven hundred and ninety-two. Seven hundred and ninety-two. Seven hundred and ninety-two!